I always forget how long that bass intro goes. Yay rules! I, I heard the proper amount of meh. Good job. Thank you. All right. So we do have rules. They are important. They keep us safe and stuff. So here they are. Rule number one. Thou shalt not sue. It's not a demand. It's a request. If something happens, if you find yourself injured either physically or emotionally, <laughs> just give us a chance to make things right before you talk to your lawyer. Okay? Yeah. All right. Thank you. Rule number two. Thou shalt sayeth cheese. Cheese! Did, did you see that? I cut the cheese on stage. It's, it's okay. That was a really bad joke. You don't have to laugh. He got it! I'm glad somebody did. Can you explain it to me later? All right, so what we ask is that you acknowledge that there are, in fact, professional photographers and a videographer here to document all this awesome stuff that happens. So, you may find yourself in front of a lens. That happens for one of two reasons. One, you are doing awesome things. Yay! Yay! Or two, you're in front of someone doing awesome things. Not yay. So, be aware of where the cameras are. Be aware of where the spotlights are so you don't show up in someone's spotlight. Yeah. And also be aware that the microphone on that camera is really sensitive, especially you people down here in the cuddle pit. So, Keep all that in mind and yeah. Okay? Okay. Alrighty. Rule number three. Thou shalt be high in spirits alone. May maybe not that high in spirits. Thank you, Mr. Strand. Okay, what we ask is that because this is in fact the state of Texas, there are certain things that are not legal within the state of Texas. We're not gonna judge what you do in your own home, but if you can't share it with a cop who's not as cool as we are. Don't bring it here, okay? Yeah. Alrighty. Rule number four, thou shalt clap, damn it. Keeping it classy. Anyway, so thank you for clapping. But what that means is that as performers, what we crave is feedback, especially positive feedback. So if you see something that you like up here, then let the performer know as enthusiastically as you possibly can so they know that you liked it and so they will keep coming back here and doing it just to entertain you. Can you do that for me? Yeah. Glad to hear it. Rule number five, thou shalt take thy positivity pill. Thomas Jefferson, if you will. Oh, he's a juggler. Well, yeah. Say hi to Pilly. Hi, Pilly. Say hi to the nice people, Pilly. <laughs> I'm sorry, Pilly. I'll never do it again until next week. Okay, so that's Pilly. He is our mascot. He reminds us to be positive. That does not mean that you have to be super nice and sweet and oh boy, I'm there. Because, like, seriously, nobody needs those cavities. Mm -mm. Instead, what we ask is that you be positive, that you be supportive of the people who get up here to do this thing. There are times when it gets real in a big way on this stage. So if you can make this a safe, supportive place for that to happen, then amazing things will take place. Can you do that for me, open stage? Thank you. Rule number six, thou shalt engage. Wait, no. what, what happened to Sulu? <laughs> no, wait a second, I was talking to that guy yesterday. He was like at the craps table and, and like at the space strip club. Oh my. He's sick from the club. <laughs> uh, I, uh, I was doing space research for a space <laughs> research paper about <laughs> space. space. Um, yeah, okay, so maybe, maybe I was just there for the pretty holograms, I don't know. But 
What we ask is that you engage in this show. You're already here, you've paid your 10 bucks, so just watch the show you came to see, am I right? All right, so what we ask is that you take your phones, laptops, tablets, any other electronic devices, tweet the hell out of us later, hashtag open stage, but for now, just turn them off. And while the performers are up here, any conversations you may have, let them wait until later and just watch the show, okay? Okay. Thank you. Rule number seven, thou shalt not keep score. If you look behind you at the judges' table, you'll see that we sold it for beer money. Yeah. This is not American Idol. It's not The X Factor or The Voice or The uh, Celebrity Apprentice. The, the, which is really good because, like, I, I really don't think Russ would look good in that kind of hairpiece. Yeah. But what we ask is that you don't keep score against others or yourself. This is about new acts, new performers, new ideas. And sometimes they're a little bit rough. It happens because this is where we come to try all that stuff out in a safe, supportive place. So, if you see something up here that you think to yourself, Psh, I could do better than that, well then get up here and do it. Quit being so judgy, you doucher. <laughs> it also means that you may think to yourself, man, that is amazing, that is, that is the coolest thing I have ever seen. I could never in a million years do that, which is garbage, you totally can, and we will help you get there. So don't keep score against others or yourself, and you'll have a much better time, okay? Okay. Thank you. Rule number eight, thou shalt play nice together. This is a really friendly place. We like to keep it friendly, but not too friendly. <laughs> play. <laughs> yeah, got my eye on you, even though I'm totally blind because of the spotlights. <laughs> oh, sorry. You didn't know you liked to watch. Well, this is true. I do like to watch, but... Usually I prefer to be on stage where everyone can watch me. My brain just exploded. I bet it did. Yeah. 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 What we ask is that you do the best you can to keep this place respectably friendly. We understand there's a lot of really open-minded people here. Just don't let your brain, you know, don't let your mind get so open that it falls out of your head. Consent is sexy, right folks? Yeah. So make sure that if you see something really shiny that you want to play with, that you ask before you touch him or her. Okay. Yes, Chris? Bring the noodles this time. <laughs> Rule number nine, thou shalt respect the venue. You look around, you see a lot of nice stuff. Some of it we own, some of it we don't. We don't want to have to replace any of it, so don't break anything. That means don't put your drinks on the floor where I promise someone will knock them over. Not necessarily because they're clumsy, because sometimes people just feel like knocking over drinks, because, you know, people can be douchers like that. Yeah. I'm just clumsy. Well, okay, you are clumsy, and because you're so tall, you can't actually see where your feet are, so it makes it that much... It's, it's okay, I've known him for years, and he still hates me, so it's whatever. I will kick over your drinks. He will kick over my drinks, not because he's clumsy, but because I'm me. Yes. Um, so, if something happens, if something gets broken, spilled, whatever, let us know so we can fix it as fast as possible, okay? Okay. All right. And lastly, rule number 10. Thou shalt not confuse this with a democracy. We work really, really hard to make this show happen. I know that I act like a total goofball. Russ pretends he's not you know, very good at maintaining order. In actuality, that's an act that we do to make this thing more fun. And the reason why we're able to do it is because you folks give us the respect and courtesy of, you know, following the rules we give you. And we appreciate that. But it also means that sometimes we do have to tell you not to do something like, you know, throwing knives across the room. Don't do that, because... Like, it's dark, and I don't care how good your aim is, in this kind of lighting, it's not going to go well for anybody. Just say it. Just say it. But, because we're in charge, that means we can do stuff for you. It means that if you need an extra table, you need us to grab some more chairs, you need, like, a 300,000 foot tall... Johnny. What? There's no way we can even fit whatever it is you're about to say in here. Oh. Okay, so we can't actually get you a 3,000 foot tall anything, really. 
but we can totally get you extra tables and chairs. And if it's not tables and chairs, but you still need it, let us know and we'll try to get it for you. Can you do that for me? All right. Well, thank you for your compliance with the rules. And now that all the rules and stuff are out of the way, please put your hands together and give a big welcome to your master of ceremonies, Russ! <laughs> 